looking for wildlife biology and military news today i don't usually get the overlap we're diving into the weirdest reef i've ever heard of nazi bombs in the baltic sea yep you've heard that right so after world war ii tons of nazi munitions were dumped off bombs torpedo heads mines just dumped into the baltic sea it is estimated there's 300,000 tons of unexploded ordnance down there why? Because the Baltic seabed, mostly flat, muddy, boring, and there weren't so many natural rocks to cling to. So these munitions have given uh, this plot test to all these marine life places to live. So instead of being a toxic wasteland, these rusty war willocks are thriving underwater condos, starfish, mussels, anemones, fish, and they're all clinging to the top of bombs. So what do we do? So the thought is that maybe we should remove the bombs safely, replace them with artificial reefs so the critters don't lose their accidental homes. At the end of the day, it's a crazy reminder. Life finds a way even when it's hanging out in the very weapons built to destroy it. I'm Will Boss. Stay curious. And don't go picking up old warheads uh, near your next snorkeling trip. Peace out.